morning my friends we are all geared up the girls are back into their position <laughs> like just checking out we are ready to go to bister village where the old designers outlets are and have um, a looking around and see shop i have never been there before and i'm very excited to go and have a look at the shops Who remembers the film Pretty Woman when Julia Roberts returns to the luxury shop and gets spoiled with clothes and accessories by Richard Gere? Isn't it every woman's dream to be in a designer shop and be able to buy whatever you like? I am in Prada and I'm going to try these dresses and the lady is going to take some shoes to try with them. My friends, this is the most beautiful dress. this dress but it's too small I can't close it it's very very pretty though I love the white velvet very very much so beautiful and the shoes these are Prada shoes it goes perfectly with this dress it's too small unfortunately anyway Let's try the other ones. This white velvet dress with the pink flowers, although on the hanger doesn't look much, but when I wear it, it's so beautiful. I would love one day to find another dress like this, exactly like this. And it has got all the little, um, you see these studs with the little flowers. This is one of the most beautiful dresses I've ever seen in my life. Now I'm going to try this one because I... Okay, my friends, I really like this one very, very much. I really love this detail, the cotton uh, um, sangallo uh, neck and uh, these little buttons, white uh, and the blue color and the way it, I think is a bit short. I was younger that would have been perfect but I think it is a bit short but it's very pretty love the sleeves yeah you just need to be warm with the pads yeah this is the look very pretty okay my friends this is the last dress from Prada I love the details on the wrists and the collar and this pink bow here and uh, it's not a long dress it's short again but it's okay I would wear it with the dark tights black tights I really love the details here I think it's so pretty the sleeves is a um, much lighter material than the blue one this is a bit sheer but because it's black you don't see through i love the pleated the skirt and um, really really pretty i'm gonna try it with the shoes on i love the pink because um same pink as the bow We have decided that this dress, although it's very, very beautiful, I love the velvet detail, the pink bow. Um, it's very elegant, very light also. I don't know, I think the blue one, I would wear it a little bit more, but I'm in love with this dress. I'm in love. 
Anyway, let's go and try another one. The lady here showed me this um, creamy, let's say cream dress. So I'm gonna try this one now. Okay, my friends, this is the cream one. I don't have the right bra for this dress, but as you can see, it is nice. It is a lovely dress, definitely. It's, uh, it's like a nighty, maybe more evening appropriate. Yeah, definitely evening appropriate. Um, yeah, I'm gonna show you. Yeah, I much prefer the other ones. So this is uh, the cream one. discovered this um, water is lemon and ginger um, flavor and there is no sugar but is uh, not really strong like ginger it's uh, quite sweet um, because of uh, apple juice concentrate that there is inside it's very natural and very nice if you have the opportunity to pop by in pret a manger you should try because it's really nice if you love uh, lemon and ginger that's um, bought two bottles and then there is um, these sandwiches i bought two for later on because i don't know what time we will get home this is avocado tomatoes and salad and i think olives as well olive uh, uh, black olives the bread is really nice with uh, grain in it and then i bought this dessert which is mango, bananas, there is some granola, it's uh, plant-based as well, and uh, it's very, very nice. If you like uh, the taste of mango, the creaminess of the banana, crunchiness uh, of the granola, I'm sure you would love this dessert. So this is uh, for later on. Hello my friends, it's really late at night, it's 10 o'clock, we arrived late at home and by the time we have tidied up a little bit, you can actually have a preview of what the house looks like now, it has been painted all white is nice and pretty anyway i did promise earlier on that i would have shown you what we bought in bister village 
and um, Vister Village is a beautiful place where there are all designer shops and uh, I managed to buy something in Prada obviously it's a present from my boyfriend he very very kindly wanted to treat me and that's why I have been able to purchase this item and you have seen while I was there I have tried some clothes so now we are going to unpack together I'm really really grateful to have the opportunity to have had this experience I had that experience that I remember watching when I was younger, Julia Roberts and Pretty Woman, and uh, I thought it would never happen to me, and it happened. So I'm going to start with uh, this purchase, La Cruze, that you all know. Um, in TK Maxx, they sell these um, items from La Cruze. And um, there was a shop there in Bister Village. It was really lovely. It was my first time there in Bister Village. And we bought this pot. I'm going to show you. It's not orange because I know you know me well. I don't really like orange color. Here we are. I bought it in cream. As you can see, this white cream color with a lid because I really like a lid. I think it's practical when I cook, whatever I cook, having a lid, it helps whatever you are preparing. It has got this long handle and this little handle on this side is a nice small on the small size, but for a milk sauces, this is very good and practical. I love cast iron. I have another little pot like that, a little bit bigger, and I find cooking in that pot is amazing. Everything cooks so much better. And uh, since I had that cast iron pot, from now on, I would only want to have cast iron. And I really like the color of this one. And it was outlet price, so it was half price compared to a normal retailer, high street retailer. And now I show you what we bought in Prada. We went into a few designer shops and I went and had a look at everything and it was really lovely just to have um, a look around and see all these beautiful dresses and then we went into Prada and I would have never thought of coming back out with two bags, two bags. So you have all seen me trying those beautiful dresses Unfortunately, they didn't all fit uh, properly. Um, one was too small and the other two, one I thought it was too light for um, the season. I'm always very, very cold. And so I ended up buying this one. This is the blue dress with the white collar and um, the trim, the details on the sleeves. It's a three-quarter sleeve, it's a very simple, it is very short, but I would wear it with uh, dark tights, with blue tights uh, and uh, high, knee-high boots. I'm forever grateful. It comes with, um, it's a brand new actually. I tried on another one and then when you go and buy, they give you a brand new one, not the one I tried. Um, I love the big pearls bottom buttons that has got three pearls buttons and um, let me so it is like this it's got this beautiful detail the, the collar it's all the style this dress it reminds me of um, when my mom was younger she had clothes and dresses like this one very much. Even the, the cut, uh, how it fits me. It reminds me of the 60s or 70s. Anyway, probably 60s. Um, so yes, this is the dress I bought. I was pampered. It was the most beautiful experience. All the personnel in Prada was amazing. I really love this kind of style of Prada. And uh, 
I still can't believe it. I'm over the moon for this beautiful experience that I had the chance to live today. And then the last item I'm going to show you today that I have purchased in Prada is girls I'm very grateful for this experience and I don't know if it will ever happen again something like that so I'm appreciating every moment of this experience I'm really really happy and the other item I bought I'm sure many of you are guessing what it is is a bag and um, it, it doesn't happen every day that I buy a bag and I'm going to show you it's all well wrapped it comes in the dust bag and this is the bag as you can see it has got a little logo here I didn't like anything that shows the logo too much um, I'm going to take off this paper here now and it has got this uh, uh, is it a key ring where you can put um, I suppose it's the same it reminds me very much of um, Hermes, is it Hermes who did this first? So there is this key ring. I suppose it's just for um, a beauty purpose or do you really put your keys uh, attached? Do you really attach the keys here? I don't know, let me know if you just leave it as it is hanging on the back or you would um, do something. Yes, so all these items were um, outlet prices so a good a good opportunity to buy a designer item so inside there is um, another little pouch Prada pouch with uh, a strap a normal strap thin strap like that and then uh, there is another strap which is this one which is like this, this color blue with the stripes, which I like very much. Although I would like to wear it like that. See, in the nook of my arm, this way, this is the way I would, I would carry this bag. And uh, I like the size because you can fit a laptop, my little laptop, and you can fit uh, sandwich, water, um, anything you need for a day out is a good size. If I put the strap on, then uh, this is uh, what it looks like. And that's, that's how it fits. That's, what do you think? I know it doesn't happen every day and uh, it will probably be, that's it, for um, many, many years to come. But I will always be remembering this beautiful day shopping designer items in Bister village and uh, I'm so happy for this uh, bag and then it is um, very spacious inside it has got some um, something inside this is um, paper to keep the shape so it's quite roomy that's all the space that there is there is um a little pocket on the side there is a magnetic clip and then on this other side if any of you is interested in this kind of bag it has got a zip a zip pocket on this side and otherwise there is a big central compartment and it doesn't have any other pockets so that's it. I suppose I would wear it this side where there is no logo, nothing. I prefer um, not really showing, oh, I have a Prada bag. So that's it. That's my experience for today in Pister Village. I really enjoyed the experience. 
we had a lovely lunch in a beautiful um, cafe bistro very parisian style the food was lovely and now it's time to get ready and go to bed and uh, Actually, I need to edit this video for you to watch it tomorrow morning and I hope you enjoy it. Please give me a big thumb up if you enjoy this uh, little um, haul. I have shown you what I bought in Bister Village and um, there will be more to come. I need to show you all those boxes. Uh, um, they are um, homeware haul from Zara, H&M, Sophie Wallport, uh, something from Amazon so there are all items for the house so stay tuned for that and um, subscribe to my channel if you're new and you want to see more and I will show you better the house and the progress in the daylight in the next couple of days and I will see you all in my next video thanks for watching bye bye Joy to the ones who lost their hope